Passport stamped. Welcome to Greece. Greece is a beautiful country. With up to 6,000 islands, the total land area of Greece is comparable in size to England or the state of Alabama. An expression that means like, hooray! Like it's a celebratory expression. So everybody, oh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay, the next thing we're going to learn is we should probably know how to say hello. Yeah. 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 Try writing your name. There's alpha, beta, gamma, delta, epsilon, and zeta. Wow. The alphabet. I printed off all the kids' names in Greek so that they could see the difference with the Greek alphabet and practice writing them. Ooh, you're done? Mom, Caleb, Mom, they have two of the exact same letters. That is weird. Janae, <laughs> you are doing a really great job. Yes, Here's Elise's. Ah. And now we're going to listen to their music. Now, they are known for a specific style of music and a certain instrument that I want you guys to listen for. It's called the bazooka. So now we're going to learn the Greek national dance, which is called the Kalamatiana. Okay, you guys think you're ready to dance? Yeah. yeah. Five, six, seven, eight, step. Yeah. Behind, step, forward. Okay. Hey. Hey, I got it, I got it. Step, step, step. That's just walk, walk, walk. We can do that. Okay. Step. Behind, step forward, walk, walk, walk. Step, behind, step forward, step, walk, walk, walk. 
forward, step back, back again, up. up. Oh. <laughs> step behind, step forward, walk, walk, walk. Behind, step forward, walk, walk, walk. We're doing some indoor target practice with Nerf guns. Ooh, very good. Isaac's going from the 10 foot distance. Can I push the string right up to his lips? Look how it's smashing his lips. See the score up here? They're keeping the score up his lips. Oh. Oh. This is the outdoor distance. Did you see the difference between their bows and our bows? Yeah. Ours won't even make it that far. Can you pull it back? Up here, Caleb, don't put it on your face because it's going to go back and hit your nose. It's going to really hurt. Like that? Oh, really on Caleb's bow. So there you go! I just wanted to try it from back there. Hey, hey! Oh. A bullseye! Is that you, Caleb? Yeah, he hit a bullseye on oh, the, the wrong bullseye. target. A bullseye is a bullseye. Nice. <laughs> Shoot. Yeah! Got it, Laura. Oh. You make it look so easy, don't they? Yeah. Eat it. Nice! nice. Okay. Since we're pretending to be in Greece today, we wanted to have Greek food for lunch, so we're trying a bunch of new things. I haven't had barely any of this before. It is gluten free. You get to try the dolma. Okay. The tzatziki sauce. You like it? You train a little bit of everything. My mom was. So lamb is out. Jene is always with Gunner. Gunner, go pee pee. The time machine. We just went on a long journey to ancient Greece. So here is a base where they're always picking, right? This afternoon we're doing a little bit of time travel and learning about ancient Greece and the ancient Olympics. So the ancient Olympics was actually a religious festival about the god Zeus, I didn't know that, and it happened every four years. They didn't have very many events then. I think she said they started with the 200 meter dash. Only men could compete back then. And so much of what we know about the ancient Olympics we learned about from pottery because the images that were painted on pottery that has been found tells us so much about the culture and things of that time. That's just amazing. So now the kids are designing their own pottery so that if someone in the future were to find theirs, it would tell them something about them. Nice! Yes! It's stuck! Tell us the over there. Oh, almost. Like oh. <laughs> yeah! Starting to rain. The cat does not want to be in the rainstorm. <laughs> it's starting to really come down. Go get your swimsuits on. Yeah! Swimsuits on. This is serious rain. It is not just sprinkling, but there's no thunder. So we said. Okay, and they're all out in the ring.
This is not as exciting spot. No one can get me because I can't get caught on one time going underwater. You guys ready for the Greek trivia challenge? Yes. yes. What is the capital of Greece? Athens and Athens. Good job. You guys got it. What kind of money do they use in Greece? No, that is like, I know. That's like, I know that. No, that's a room is spelling. Are you looking it up? No. <laughs> Three, two, one. Greek coins and euros. So they do use coins that are called euros. What color are the homes and roofs predominantly in Greece? White and blue. You were watching. What is the temperature today in Athens? What? The answer is 95. What? I Because we we're gonna do synchronized swimming. You guys have the whole week to prep for it. You are divided into three groups. The big girls. Woo! The boys. Yeah! The Preston. little girls. <laughs> and the moms. Woo! And I, I will be doing a solo dance. <laughs> Each of the kids has had a chance to research and learn about an Olympian, and now they're going to present to the group. What is your name? Tenny. And who are you presenting on? Um, Kayla and Eddie. Okay, come watch your video. Special thanks to Caleb for helping her edit. Hello, my name is Janae. I'm learning about Kitty Ledecky. She's a fast swimmer, and she got... She can go on the water, swim, 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 I'm presenting on the men's gymnastics team. This face is Yes, out. Where do I put my There it is. Oh.